Guess <laughs> I'll play Peach, you know? So the thing is, I've, I play a little mag, and I just shield grab. Yeah? You, 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 have you, you've seen Royal Max recovery? Yeah. Yeah. Or lack of. Yeah. 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 But neutral oh game, I think, I think, in my opinion, possibly one of the best neutral games in, in the entire game. Who's this? Uh, Lil Mac. He's Fair so enough. quick, his, his forward tilt comes out on like frame two or something stupid, silly like that. Like, and it seems to be given Flat Feet a run for his money. I yeah. mean, because as you said, Flat, Flat Feet doesn't have a great neutral game. Well, I, 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 as a player, I think he's like pushing Ganondorf to its limits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sort of thing. That could, oh, that down oh B. My oh, God. the down B goes horizontally as opposed to um, straight down. Yeah, as so it's a really good recovery tool. That's it. That's, See, that's, 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 that's like I was back. talking about with the uh, horizontal that's, recovery. That's, yeah. that, um, that was incredible. Yeah, okay. Some custom moves are cool. <laughs> I'm personally not in favor of customs. That... The, the stuff he's got with Ganon here. It's cool. That's, that's pretty cool. I feel like it, it enhances the character. It doesn't yeah. make it cheesy. It doesn't, it doesn't like, make him overpowered. Like the wind box punch for DK. That's just I cheesy. played Mojo's custom Donkey Kong. And it was like I was playing a character I'd never played before. Yeah. He got up B. I can rec he's just a recovery, which is like a weird like tornado thing. Yeah. I, just couldn't, I couldn't do anything. I got, I got bodied. It dropped me straight down and loses. But that's why I'm not in favor of customs personally. That's because so cool. Yeah. It is. That's really neat. I don't know. I, I love. I love seeing flat feet do well on this Ganondorf. I think it might be seven, seven thirty, yeah. like against customs. Because this is cool. Yeah. I really like the. God. Very nice. Damn. I really like the Ganondorf customs. I think it really enhances the game. I think. Yeah. I think customs need to be. Super armor. Yeah. I think two of Little Max smash attacks have super, have super armor. What I like about Pino's um, Little Mac man is that he isn't going to the ledge. You'll see on For Glory, you'll face yeah. a Little Mac, and they'll just dash attack, and then that's a dead Little Mac, straight up. He's content to just... Set the neutral. Yeah. Oh, that KO oh, punch. There we go. This, that could be it. Oh, that's, that's it. It's gone! And Pino takes the first game. That was impressive. That's that a lot better showing than what he had against... Um, who was that in the first Vinny? game? No. Oh, oh yeah. That yeah. was a lot better than what he did against Vinny. Uh, cause Vinny's a Toon Link. Yeah, 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 yeah. That Toon Link bodied him. Like, oh, really? Let's be real. He bodied his, uh, his Little Mac, it bodied his Peach, he was gone. Like, wow. that man had no chance. Just projectiles, or...? Uh, no, I wouldn't, I would say it's a mix of, like, using projectiles to cover his entrance, and then punishing Little Mac's bad recovery by shooting projectiles at him while he was off stage, and he just couldn't recover. Uh, I think if Little Mac gets touched while he's off stage at all, he's gone. Yeah, that's nine. Wait, Charizard? What? Wait, 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 wait. Flat has a Charizard. Custom Charizard is a thing. Yeah. Custom Charizard jumps tier list. He's got like um like a really cool rock break, right? It's got like a yeah, shit ton of armor yeah, on yeah. it. Yeah. And so his side B is really neat. So you'll hopefully you'll use it. It's like a like a tornado. And it doesn't just go like like the regular flare that just sends you off the stage. Like yeah, it's it's kind of silly. Oh, Pino with that custom side beyond little man. Why is this even a Charizard color? It's just slightly darker. There it is. Wow, that's cool. Oh, and it leads into a combo. It has, that's awesome. Imagine that, but upbeat. Same thing. Yeah. I'm imagining. I imagine he's running the same shit. Okay. Okay, I've got to go. I've All got right. a match. No so worries. Oh, good luck on your game. Yeah, just. I mean, if you want to find somebody else to cover for you, I'm cool. But I can... Oh, and that's a dead Little Mac. Charizard's doing work for good old Flat Feet. It's good to see. I mean, Flat Feet, I, I've got to admit, a little bias. Uh, I'm not a fan of Pino's Little Mac, purely based on the fact that uh, it's the reason that I don't own a copy of Smash 4 for Wii U, because uh, I sort of lost that tournament because of uh, Pino's... Fucking Little Mac. Charizard. Oh, good covery of his um, of his entrance there from Pino. I mean, he's got a he's got a percent deficit, and he could easily make that back and land the KO punch. He's got a lot of tools where he can get back into this game. But for now, it is looking like oh, is that it? Oh wow! And Fight Feet takes the second game. That neutral B is so good at covering that. Uh, that poor recovery from Little Mac, and you know, just the slight stun on it, because Little Mac's upbeat is so bad in the fact that 
very rarely will it instantly grab ledge. So, I mean, just the slight stun on Charizard is enough to... Because I'm not sure... I don't think that's a custom... You can't custom neutral bees, right? I'm 90% sure you can't custom neutral bees. I don't know a lot about customs, if I'm honest, because... I'm not usually a huge fan of them, because the ones I see are just, like, super cheesy. But, um, we're on to Duck Hunt, which is a stage where I think Pino is going to do very well on. Good Rock Break, though. Powered through his attack with the armor. But, yeah, because it's very spacious on the ground level, Pino's going to have a good time on the stage. He's just going to be able to play about, go for his, you know, whatever janky little Mac stuff he wants to go for. And Flatbeat's gonna have a tough time covering it because, I mean, it's not like uh, Flatbeat's opposed to, you know, ground fights and all that, but, you know, it's not, it's, let's be honest, you're not gonna be as good as Little Mac. Very lucky with the tree there. I'm not sh I don't think that was calculated. That can't be a dead Little Mac, is it? No. Okay. Very good. I think that's also a good thing because of the angle of the stage on the edges, it's going to be very hard for um, Flatfeet to get the same gimp he was getting last time. And, oh, you can see that he's fishing for the KO Punch, and Flatfeet's very, very wary of this. And, uh, to be honest, I'm not sure if he's being too respectful of this. Is that a gimp? No, it's not. Very good from Pino. Timing it in between the Charizard's uh, flame to get in there and actually get the recovery. Uh, you know, and Pino's doing a real good job. He's fishing for these uh, up smashes out of, uh, uh, you know, running up smashes. And there, you know, he covers a lot of ground and Chancellor just has a bad time getting down to the ground level to even hit the little map. Armor on that forward smash. Covers Charizard as he's trying to come down to the ground. And now we're stuck in a situation where Charizard's stuck against the edge. Flat. Oh, nah, not a kill, bro. Okay, but a good forward air and that. Sh oh, nah, covered by the back air. Okay, that's gonna be the kill. I was about to say that could kill, but I forgot that you know he'd been sent very high, so he was just able to float back to stage. So uh, again, Pino just looking so strong. You know, anything slightly more powerful than that? No, is that Charizard dead? He's gone. I guess he used all of his flight when he was trying to get on top of Pino. But either way, Pino advances and Toro Flatfeet doesn't make it.